Good morning, Roberto. Did you sleep well? I made you breakfast. You know, maybe you wouldn't be so tired if you stopped rolling out of the house every time I leave. People are going to realize there's something different about you. If you got turned into another wheel in someone's car, I wouldn't know how to react. Stop staring at me like that. I'm only trying to protect you, Roberto. Sir, could I help you? I don't know who you think you are, but I am tired of waking up to my yard in shambles and you better keep you and your tire away from my house. I'm not going to warn you again. Sir, I'm, I'm sorry, but uh, I didn't do anything. Don't play dumb with me. I have seen that tire around your place. I know it's yours. You think it's funny breaking people's stuff? Or did your tire do it. Sir, if you or that filthy piece of rubber touch my yard again, I'm calling the cops. And maybe I'll take matters into my own hands. I have to take the blame for your mess. Don't you have anything to say for yourself? Thank you so much for taking me seriously. I'm gonna go to the store. Don't leave this house. thinks he is whenever I take that tire from him. Wait, what? How, how is that even possible? No time. Break other people's stuff, now mine. Look look at all this dirt on all these prints on the stairs. What the heck is this even from? My dad's gonna kill me if I don't fix this. Way to be grateful, man. Roberto, I need you to go. This isn't worth it. I need you to be out next week. I didn't want to see you. Oh, I even hope you find a new place. I'm, s I'm sorry! Roberto, I'm home. Sorry about the outburst. Roberto, you home? Oh crap. Not again. Sorry, it's 
It's not what it looks like. If you think that I'm gonna let some tire trash my yard, then, well, you better give me a good reason why I shouldn't just shred this tire right now, right here. Mr. Favero, I can assure you that tire is not alive. I know he's alive. Sir, please don't. No, give me one reason why I shouldn't shred him to bits. You know what? I'm not gonna give you a reason. What? Haven't you been putting him up to this? No, I haven't been putting him up to it. But keep him, he's yours. He's been giving me nothing but trouble anyway. I already told him to move out next week. Just don't do anything to him. Make something useful out of him. It'll stop him from destroying your stuff anyway. I guess you can call it a gift for all the trouble. I'm sorry. Bye, Roberto. How about a swing? <laughs>